Hello everyone and welcome. Our footballing travels have taken us to the Midlands. We're at Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Aston Villa and they take on Brighton. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield would be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's the starting eleven for Aston Villa. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. Thank you, Villa Park. Enjoy the game. And so the battle commences. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Daniel Carter. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Daniel Turner. Hansen. Pacheco. Danielle Turner. Mailing. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Lehman. And a long way out here. Well, in actual fact, it ended up being a simple claim for the keeper. Robinson has space for them here. Might jump in front. And a good take under duress there. Corsi. Pacheco. Well, failing in her quest to keep it in play. And a throw in coming up. Hansen. Possession one. Elisabeth Terland. Might be a chance here. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And when through on goal, she makes no mistake. She just hits it so cleanly and with power. That's a great finish. Well, back underway. And 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next.
throw in coming up for Brighton and foul it is then And that was a very fine read. Emma Kulber. And the emphasis is on creativity. And it might be. Oh, it's goalkeeping at its finest. Absolutely right. That is a wonderful save. Top class stuff from the keeper. And over it comes. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Oh, the threat is there. It's got to be, and it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Mailing on to Corsi. And there to intervene. Good looking sequence. And there's the feed into the box. And a time for cool heads. Kirsty Hansen. Now, who can she play it to? The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Plenty of options. And now having a go. Pretty simple for the keeper. Alicia Lehmann. Sarah Mailing. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Well, as the stats tell us, Brighton have been second best in Hang terms of possession. Hang on a minute, Stewart. Opportunity unfolding and denied by the keeper. Impressive. Lost possession. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. That's a foul and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, that attempt there that I think she's going to try to erase from the archives. Yeah, the less said about that, the better. That was a really poor effort on goal. Not a good free kick at all. Passon. Sarah Mailing. Rachel Daly.
Dali. Delivering it into the box. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Effective pressure to regain possession. Lee. Casey Robinson. Could play it in. Wonderful chance. It's still alive. Just cleared away in the nick of time. And the referee's whistle, meaning that the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Villa Park. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Well, they've lost the ball. Could be. There it is. A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So there we have it, 2-1. Sadi. How well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Hansen getting forward well it came to nothing in the end and the counter attack is on options available do they have the guile to open up the defence well it peters out but they still might be able to do something can she score and it's come off the keeper well that's the end of that for now Mailing. Turner. Hansen. Now Corsi. Pacheco. And into the last 30 minutes now. Sarah Mailing. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build up. But then the one that goes astray. A reminder that foul and abusive language will not be tolerated in the stadium. Thank you. Sari. Lee. Carter. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then.
Hassan. Alicia Lehmann. Space on the flank. Textbook defending inside the box. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Promising looking attack. Is it going to be? Oh, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. It's a short corner. Firing is in. I'm not testing the keeper at all with that effort. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. It needs an accurate cross. Takes the shot. No problems for the keeper. Well, nearing full time, and here's the question. Are they going to come up just that little bit short? Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it's been close, but I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game. They've just not created enough clear-cut chances. There's still time, though. They just need to get the ball into the danger area. Options in the middle. Oh, surely! The save was a good one. Rachel Corsi. Sarah Mailing. Alicia Lehmann. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. She's made a really important challenge. Ten minutes to go then. Lehmann. Well, the fans want her to take on the shot. Nicely timed tackle. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And time for the change now. Well, she's gone for the short one. This could square the game. Tenacious tackling. Excellent defending there. Allen. Alicia Lehmann. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. And lining it up. A good and fair challenge. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. This could finish it! Oh, what a fine save, and a timely one, Stuart. Well, that does give them some hope, because that would have been the end. Good refereeing, waiting for a natural break before administering the caution. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And over it comes. It might still be problematic. Firing it towards goal. Keeper getting the touch. 
And that will be all for this game. The referee blowing the whistle and Aston Villa have to digest the taste of defeat. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time.